What the? <laughs> oh my gosh. Hello Reapers, my name's Scythe, and today we're gonna be playing some Subnautica. This game ended up recently launching on Steam. That is to say it's come out of early access. It's been in early access for like a billion years or something. Oh my gosh. I've seen lots of other YouTubers covering this game, so I'm very excited to be playing it for you today. Don't know whether or not we're gonna start a full series. Depends on your feedback, of course. But uh, the game is actually finished from front to finish, uh, from start to back. I mean, oh, I knocked myself out with the weird piece of metal. But uh, it's, it's an interesting game to say the least. It's pretty much a survival game where you're underwater and you're kind of forced to go to the deeper parts of the ocean, fighting more and more dangerous creatures in order to not only survive, but to hopefully end up getting out of here, right? Oh gosh, how do I actually pick up the fire extinguisher and use it? Yep, I'm using it. Oh my goodness gracious, did we get rid of the fire? Are we good? Where's my own volume here? Okay, okay. Woo! What's with this weird touchpad thing? Do I use it? Booting in emergency mode. Hello? Is it trying to talk to me? I have a real life phobia and fear of creatures in the water. I'm just going to say that outright. So that's why I'm hoping this video is going to be entertaining for you folks. Because of the fact that I'm going to be terrified of the creatures that we're going to fight in the deep. What? A life on an alien world. Please refer to the data bank for detailed survival advice. Good luck. What? Press tab to open and close the PDF. Okay, I don't really need to open or close it. Uh, corresponding quick select or something. Fabricator, that's right. Use repair tool. Okay, so do we get to, where? where's the tools and junk like that? So we got resources, there's basic resource. Oh gosh, this game is surprisingly in depth. Uh, here we go for getting ourselves some water. And then for our person, we got equipment. Okay, uh, O2 tank, fins to swim faster, first aid. Fire extinguisher, we already got, but I guess we would need more of it. Tools, scanner, that's definitely something we want. Battery and titanium. There's a repair tool, cave sulfur, titanium, silicon rubber. So we gotta go out into the world and find these resources, I guess, in order for us to actually, uh, yeah, go and do this stuff. What is this? Can we do anything in here? What the, ooh, okay, we got flares. Uh, how do I actually get those in my inventory? We got filtered water and we got a nutrient block, which gives us some food. I see. So how do we actually consume? Ah, there we go. And then this gives us, uh, how much? 20 water? I guess they want us to just use them both right now anyways, and then we'll just use the rest as we see fit. Whoopsie daisy, tab is the button to close all of that stuff. All right, what about this? Got some medical supplies. This is pretty cool, I kinda like it. Repair tool to repair the radio, huh? All right, well, anyways, let's climb the ladder and see what... What was that? What the... <laughs> oh my gosh! The Aurora suffered a failure. Cause unknown. Zero human life signs detected. Zero human life? What about me? I can see my feet! That's kind of cool. I turn around like a freak. Like, look at this. That's so cool! Oh, it's beautiful. Hey, what's that? What's that over there? Is that something? Huh? Oh gosh, I don't want to do it. I don't want to do it. I hate underwater. I got to change. Let, let me actually see. There's a field of view option here. Let's crank that up to 11. Ah, I can see beside myself. Hello? What? Left click to something? Grab him! I wanted to grab him. I don't know what that was. Okay, what was that weird thing that was over here? Where's our oxygen? It's over in the bottom left there. Uh, there's all sorts of different equipment you can end up getting or something to that effect. I'm not exactly sure. Can I grab him? Aha! Boomerang? Can I throw him? What do I do? Do I just grab them to detect them and figure out... Yeah, I'm discovering parts of these guys. Okay, so we got something over there. Is that just... Ah, uh, it's just coral. That's not really anything useful. Acid mushrooms, aha, so we needed that in order to make a battery, I'm assuming, right? How much can we actually carry in our inventory? Of course they don't stack, why Why would they stack? Table, coral, something or rather, we need a knife in order to actually get that, I think. Break stone, okay. Hey, what's that? We got some thing down here, some salvage. We're also slowly running out of oxygen, gotta be really careful about that. We got creatures down in the caves there. This is so cool! Like, I, I know that so many people actually play this game, but I can't even believe, like, how awesome this game is. I love it. This is great. Dude, I don't know why I keep gathering more of those mushrooms. I don't need them. Like, seriously. Okay. 
you guys look really weird and freaky. When we start getting to the scare, like, I'm sitting here and I'm like, ha ha, this is such a cool game. And then when I end up getting to the scariness, uh, like whatever that thing is, that's when it's just gonna be like, oh yeah, I don't know if I wanna play this game anymore. You know what I mean? Should we go over and talk to it? Would it kill me? It's making weird noises. Swim to the surface. Okay, I'm gonna be down for that. Let's go see if we can end up making ourselves a battery. Can we go into our uh, station here from the bottom? Yes, we most definitely can. Okay, that's cool. Uh, fabricator, resources. It shows us which ones we can make. Titanium and glass. What about the battery? Rubber, titanium ingot. Battery requires copper ore. Okay, so we need to get copper ore in the first place. Ooh. That's kind of unique. What the deployables? We can get a waterproof locker so that we could store some stuff. Or we can get ourselves an O2 tank, uh, which is, I guess, just extra O2 fire extinguisher. Pipes, which uh, pipe is, can be used to transport breathable air from a functional pump. Interesting. And then a floating air pump. Okay, obviously. So they're wanting us to try and like build a base underwater or something, I guess. Uh, I don't necessarily want to do any of that. We'll build ourselves an oxygen tank though. I'm down for that. Can we refill it anytime we come to the surface? That would be interesting. Cooked food. Oh, so that's why we end up grabbing these fish, huh? So that we can end up getting ourselves some food. Okay, I dig it. That's cool. Glass. May as well craft a little bit more of that and then get ourselves some more titanium. What did we need? Copper? Yeah, we needed like copper and a whole bunch of other supplies because we got to get our hands on, uh, ooh, there's a titanium ingot now we can end up making. I don't know what that's actually for, but it's pretty tedious. You got to craft like a bunch of titanium to make a titanium ingot and then what? I don't know, but uh, well, let's go back into the depths of the ocean and probably end up dead. Ah, 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 weird stingray thing. Okay. The water looked a lot scarier from the outside. Well, anyways, let's go down here and check out what this thing is. And Oh, great. We got a weird coral reef over here. I don't like it. We got some crash-landed stuff over here. This should hopefully end up being helpful for us. I saw a weird creature of death that wants to kill me. No, seriously, that looked terrifying. I just want to stay away from it. Seriously, I've got problems when it comes to the fear of the water. Like... I seriously have issues. Okay, uh, oh, so the oxygen tank is just on our cells right now. It's just an equippedable item. Very interesting. So is there like anything out of this? Is there scraps or something that we can end up actually using? Because for some reason we can interact with a bunch of this stuff, but it didn't actually let us use any of it. What are you? Hello? Alien life form. Oh, I see. We can leave it on our hotbar or swap it out for another thing. I see. And then we got a whole bunch of, like, other broken junk that, for some weird reason, we can't seem to gather. But it's cool that we actually got more oxygen. I'm definitely down for that. Is the world randomly generated? That's really cool. Oh, gosh. Like, seriously, I gotta keep going for air like a freak? Like, what's wrong with my character? Where's the copper, man? Where are all the copper at? I want as much of it as I can get. Also, I want to eat some weird alien fish today. So help me. Get over here, you. Oh, we can gather a whole bunch of them so long as we have them on our hot bar, huh? Okay, cool. What about down here? Anything interesting? Ah, what the? What is it? What is it? Ah, it exploded on my face and hurt me. That was scary. I don't like it. Like, seriously. Okay, so is there a way that we can go past it now? Now that it's activated, it's not gonna attack me anymore? Okay, good, good, we're safe. Get over here, weird boomerang! Ha ha, you look delicious, as well as ugly. Oh my gosh. Um, hmm. So we got another creature up there. We got more weird things that we probably could gather so long as we ended up having the right resources. But where do we actually get said copper? Because that's what we really need. I also want to be very careful not to go too deep into the cave here, because if we do, Whoa. If we do, we're gonna end up running out of oxygen. Is this copper? What's this? That's how we end up getting copper. Okay, so this probably is going to end very badly for me, going through the cave here, but we're going to just do it anyways, because we gotta get as much copper as we need. Uh, like, we, we gotta get as much as we can get is what I mean. So, okay. He's gonna hurt me. Yeah! Can I dodge him? Ow! Jerk. No, we can't. And we got all, oh gosh. We got all sorts of scary creatures that are trying to wait to get me and eat my face. Let's get to the surface as quickly as possible. Bah! 
Oh, that was so close. Like, seriously. All righty. Those things are terrifying. And the night cometh. I don't like it. I don't like that the night time's coming, dude. I seriously don't like it at all. At least we do have a waypoint. <laughs> forever pointing us towards our ship. Because otherwise, if it wasn't pointing us to our ship, we would just be dead meat. Like, I would be dead, like, instantly. Because I'm already lost. Like, out in the big, vast ocean, and it's just like, what do I do? I don't know. I'm going to die. Hello, weird glowy fish. Can I pick you up? No, I can't. There's more copper. Yep, I need all that I can get. And, uh, we also gotta start going back home, because it's getting really dark, getting really scary. Oh, jeez. I thought this weird glowing thing over here was some type of a monster that was waiting to eat me. Uh, we got lots of weird creatures starting to show up at night as well. We gotta get out of here, dude. Like, seriously. Okay, we got in our cave down there, possibly. No, that's just weird glowy stuff. And <laughs> oh, gosh. I don't like it. 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 The underwater at night is like my worst nightmare in real life. Like, seriously, I don't want to experience it in a video game. Let's just go back home and, uh... uh Hopefully we have enough supplies to build, you know, anything. At least we are going to be able to make ourselves some delicious food. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's so good. I don't know if we necessarily need it. Why? What? Bladder fish? We can make water out of them? Aw, oh, man. So we can't actually make any more. That's kind of disappointing. I ended up using the one fish that we needed. That, that really sucks. Okay, a battery. That's what we needed for sure. Um, which required the copper ore, yep, and then copper wire. I don't know if that's something that we need. Power cell, what? Glass is something we can make, more titanium. Uh, what about all this? We can make a standard O2, high capacity O2, I see, so we can make a better one with more glass and titanium and silver ore, which is something that we don't have right now. What about tools? We can make the scanner, we can make a flashlight, which is very useful. Uh, silicone rubber. Can we actually make that? Silicone rubber, which re requires a creep vine seed cluster. Okay, that's kind of weird. Well, anyways, I guess we'll make ourselves the scanner so that we can start scanning stuff, because that's a big deal with this game. Uh, and then we gotta make ourselves... Where was the battery? Can we make an R1? What? Record alien biological data. Yep, I'll record alien biological whatever it's called. Repair tool, that's what we need. Cave sulfur and... More of that rubber that keeps making me think of butter for some reason. <laughs> I don't know why. This uh, oxygen thing could potentially end up being very useful for us, honestly speaking. But uh, let's just start working on getting some of this air stuff out of the way, all right? We're going to end up getting ourselves some glass. At least these resources are not necessarily difficult. We do need to get ourselves lots more water, though, dude. Because that's the big thing that we're running out of right now is we're thirsty. I need my wawa. Food is not a problem. It doesn't seem like it's going to be that much of an issue. Organisms, while disposing of the skeletal structure, bodily fluids, and internal organs, thus rendering them safe for human consumption. Okay, that's pretty cool lore-wise, I guess. Okay, we're gonna need, uh, do we need copper wire? Probably. We definitely need another battery, no matter what. Like, I don't care who you are, that's what we're gonna need. Uh, where was our flashlight? Oh gosh, we got a whole inventory of weird stuff here. Okay, um, flashlight. We don't need this. We can put our repair tool on number one. And I should, whoopsie daisy, I'm not used to these buttons. Storage container, right? Yeah, okay, so let's put, uh, let's put some of our food in old cooked fish. Ew. Well, let's consume it anyways. First aid kit, we probably should just have on our person. I don't know whether or not storing all of these things is a good thing. But the acid things, we're probably going to end up using disposable flare. That would actually be very useful, just because we would be able to throw it into the caves and see all of the evil that's trying to eat my face. That's pretty much all it would be for, right? Okay, let's drink some Wawa. Thankfully, we still had some. We also are really low on health. Okay, let's just heal up. There we go. I should have actually uh, checked and saw what that ended up costing us, because... Yep, uh, that's probably bad. Scanning tool! Don't scan your own face, that's weird. Can we scan any of this stuff? Do we have to scan the creatures out in the world? Oh gosh, it's nighttime. It's scary. I don't like it. This flashlight's really cool, though. Don't shine it in your face, you freak. Like, seriously, what's wrong with you? Get back here! Get back here! Trend is what? With damage to the Aurora's drive core sustained during planet four. Yeah. 
What is it saying? Is it saying that the Aurora is like the big ship that's beside us and going to end up causing us a lot of problems because we're so close to it? Can I scan it? Oh, scan. There we go. I was pressing the wrong button. That's why it was weird. That's cool that it doesn't just cancel the scan uh, as, while you're still holding the button, though. That's kind of nice. So we can kind of just scan it slowly over time. What the? What is that that we just scanned right there? I don't know. Weird seaweed creature thing. Get over here. No, get over here, you. Ah, eh, whatever. Okay, we'll scan all these little things. Man, they're so tiny. It's so difficult to scan them. There. Jeez Louise. Like, what is the problem? Gary fish? That's pretty funny. Get over here, you. I need you weird bladder fish thing. Ah, bad guy. Get out of here already. Why are those things out to eat me all the time? Like, seriously, what's their problem? I'm going to scan more of you. Why am I drowning? Ah! pay attention did I die did it just give me a game over seriously Ugh. what happened you died yep I did <sighs> did I lose everything I don't know what we lost there honestly speaking maybe it just goes towards our death counter or something at least it was a nice convenient way of skipping to the daytime seriously well you know what so help me I want to scan one of these ugly things I don't care. Even if it ends up killing me and eating my face, I'm going to scan it no matter what. Because seriously, it's kind of beautiful and scary at the same time. I'm going to sneak up behind it. Hopefully he's not going to turn around and try to eat me. Ah, one of his friends is though! What are you? Stalker! Alright, fine! Ah, he's weird. Oh boy, he's got weird gas clouds going on around him. What's going on with all that noise? Like seriously. Scan him! Scan him! Gotcha, stupid. I'm out of here. Okay. Seriously, this is uh, terrifying. That's that scared that scared me really really bad. <sighs> okay. Well, we're doing pretty good as far as our resources are concerned, except for the fact that we still got to try and get our hands on a knife. Self scan. Okay. What is that? An Easter egg? Like why would we do that? <laughs> All right. Well, we didn't end up getting any supplies that time. Uh, how do we actually get Oh my. Waterproof locker, mobile vehicle bay, and a sea, a sea glide, ingredients unknown. Where did we end up getting all that stuff? That's interesting. Uh, rubber and titanium. Okay, so what was the rubber that we needed? Power cell, two batteries, and more rubber. Rubber needs the creep vine seed cluster. Okay, I think we can get that before we call it today. I I'm pretty sure, do we just get that from these? Like the seed vines over here? This is going to be what it is? That's kind of where the stalker was hanging out? Uh, or is that what that thing is? That weird green thing? Creep vine! How do we get this resource? There's a stalker right over there. How do I actually get the creep vine? Okay, he's, uh... These guys really like hanging out in that area. I don't like it. I don't like it. This is exactly what happened the first time I played through this game. Is I, I like got so scared by all of these crazy monsters that are trying to eat me that I just stopped playing it. So I really hope that people don't want me to play this game more because seriously, I'm going to be progressing like extremely slow. What? Grab fragment collected. What? Why did we collect a fragment? Fragment? What? One of, we got 50% going on here. What are these things? What are we gathering? What is that for? Well, I don't know where to get the coral vine thing I'm a bob that it wants us to do, but we're about to gather the second one of these things, and I'm about to die! Beacon! Ah! So we scan those things to get new blueprints. All right, that's cool. We should go over to the ship, but I think we need like anti-radiation stuff to, uh, in order to go over there, right? Something like that? What happens if we scan more of these? Ah, now it just gives us raw resources. Interesting. All right, grav trap. I don't know what that is, but I'll take it. Like seriously, what what did this thing just give me? Sea glide. Okay, is it showing us the resources to gather that thing or to collect that thing now? Writhing weed. All right. Can we go and grab this at all or do anything with it? Oh my gosh, this ocean. It's so terrifying. Metal salvage. Give it to me in two seconds, anyways. I want to scan it first. Then we got in our cave over here. Then. Something that we could have scanned? Limestone chunk. Huh? Ha! Ah, ooh! I didn't know we could hit things. I like hitting things. Oh gosh, this looks terrifying. 
Like, seriously? I'm gonna get out of here? I don't want to go into a cave of death! Like, seriously? Not to mention we gotta get to the surface again? Man alive, it's gonna be nice when- ah! When we end up getting some more, like, oxygen pumps. I don't know where we get that creep vine. I don't care. I'm just gonna go back to home base and try to set up shop. That stalker is coming out of his home, though. You know what? As good a time as any. He's over there. You know what we can do? We can sneak. Sneak behind him. He's not gonna notice us go over into the creep vine area, right? <laughs> oh, there's another one. Good. Well, I gotta find out the hard way, even if I end up dead. Okay. There's a lot of them. There's a lot of them in here. Is that the creep vine? What's that weird crazy? What's this thing? What's this glowing thing? Do I do something with it or is it gonna kill me? What's this glowing thing? Is this a good thing? Creep vine seeds. Ah, there we go. That's what I needed. Yes! Oh, that's good. Okay, good. Let's go back to our ship. Because seriously, this is terrifying, dude. I don't like it. You know, I gotta tell you, the water is definitely beautiful. Is our thing, like, is this running out of batteries, by the way? There's a reason we can turn it on and off. Yeah, it is running out of batteries. Okay, well, it's a good thing I turned it off. Uh, anyways, what did we need to do? Fabricator, now we can actually make some of the rubber. Good. Make ourselves a knife. That's what I'm all about. Seriously, forget all the other stuff. The knife is like the most mandatory lubricant. Oil-based lubricant, something rather deployables. Okay, a beacon. That'd be interesting. We would be able to use that to set ourselves up uh, a spot that has a point of interest. The Seagate, which requires lubricant and copper wire. Oh, I think we can do that already. Can't we? There's our lubricant and our copper wire requires copper ore. Ah, so we're not gonna be able to get that, unfortunately. Grav trap. Uses artificial gravity to attract light objects and small creatures. More copper ore. It's actually not that expensive, surprisingly. Okay. Well, that's really cool. Uh, equipment? Was that what it was under? No. We can get ourselves some more fins. Gives us 15% more movement speed. That's actually insanely helpful. But the knife. The knife is the big thing. Air bladder. Uh, emergency flotation device. Chemical reaction produces lighter than air gas. Uh, for fast personal. Okay, so we could use that kind of as a, like a panic where it's like you gotta get to the surface You can use that and get to the surface right away. What? Following the massacre on Abraxas Prime, the knife remains the only exception Something about the knife. I don't know but we can make a knife and make ourselves some more flip flop flippers as well So that's good. I'm definitely down for that. We probably should make that thing But I'm not going to because we need water For your safety this setting cannot be overridden what can't be overridden, crazy lady? What are you even talking about? Like, seriously? Okay, let's uh, see what- Whoa, those take up a lot of inventory space, don't they? Uh, let's put the knife down on three, drink ourselves some water, and we gotta get some food in a belly. Like, seriously. Uh, is all of this stuff old? Yeah, so it's gonna take away our oxygen because it's old? Or can it make us sick? Oh, it takes our water away. Alright, well, I should have kept that in mind, but oh well, I kind of suck at this game, I'll admit that. Um, I'm gonna craft a bunch of other things, and I guess that we're gonna call it a day. Let me know, folks uh, watching at home, whether or not you want to see me do more of this, because I would be down for it. This is actually a really exciting game, extremely polished, I'm surprised. As for today, though, we are gonna have to call it, so thank you so much for watching, very much appreciate it. Don't forget to like, share, favorite, and subscribe for more daily content. That's also gonna build up loyalty points in my merch store, links are in the description for that, and for the fans that want to go the extra mile, you can donate to me for absolutely free with Gawkbox. Check links in the description explaining more of that as well. And there's also going to be links to everything about this game if you want to check it out and just play it on your own time because like seriously, I'm going to be very, very slow to progress if we do end up continuing this. Sayonara and stay epic everybody.